Hey everybody, Shavo here, back from a video and today. I'm going to be showing you how to use sound groups in Roblox. So the first thing I'm going to do is open this at the top, make sure that's open, and I'm going to go to View, open up Explore and Properties, and as you can see here, I already have three audios to use for this tutorial. If you don't have any, you can go to Toolbox and find some. They should be in here, and then you'll be able to find some sounds to use. Next, I'm going to make the sound group. So we're going to go to Explore over here. I'm going to press the plus sign. Then I'm going to insert a sound group. If you don't see it, you may have to scroll over here and then there should be a sound group. Now, once you have it, it should be inserted into wherever you press the plus sign. Now the way to use it, you can assign certain sounds to certain groups. So I'll make two of these. So I'm just going to press control D and then I'll name this one sound group two and this one sound group one. Now a good way to use this is for volume sliders and stuff. If you have an option in your game to change the volume of sound effects and the volume of music, you would want to use sound groups instead of changing every individual sound. So let's say I want these ones to be in sound group one. You can hold control to select multiple ones, then go to properties and scroll down to the bottom. There should be a sound group option. You're going to want to click right here and then click the sound group that you want to assign it to. And I'm going to put this one into sound group two. Now to test it, I'm just going to play this one and it made a little sound. But if I wanted to make it louder, since I assigned it to sound group two, all I have to do is go to the sound group two, change the volume, and then now the volume will be different. And this works for multiple sounds too. Since both of these are assigned to sound group, sound group one, if I set the volume to zero, it'll mute all of these sounds and they won't make any noise. You can also add effects to these. So if I press the plus here, I'm going to add a pitch shift effect. Then let's say I want it to be really high pitched. Now if I go to this sound and then press play, it's going to be a lot more high pitched. And that's how you use sound groups in Roblox. Make sure to set that like button and punch the subscribe button. Peace.